Hi, I'm Mariah and it is time for another work vlog. Today I'll be taking you with me to work as a pastry chef who is working at a five-star hotel for a 6 a.m. breakfast shift. Let's go. First thing I do when I wake up is pack my uniform, do my hair and get dressed and then I head out. I then punch in and I go get changed. Now I was not in the mood for it today y'all but 6 a.m shifts are better than 8 a.m shifts so i am feeling pretty good about that here's me getting dressed in the bathroom at work of course i need a pen and a marker and then i put on my safety shoes which i love because they have like this big metal toe cover so if i drop anything i will not feel a thing now that i'm all dressed i'm just going to do my hair tie it up in a little bun that's about to detach from my head put on my hat now that i'm all done it's time for me to grab my toolbox and head upstairs to begin i actually took this video a while ago before i upgraded to my newer toolbox if you guys would like to know what i keep exactly in my toolbox for everyday work and school i do have a video up on my channel so once I get upstairs, I set my toolbox down. Let's just ignore how messy that is. And then I go ahead and make myself a cup of juice because I don't really like coffee. And there's me being a dumbass and already making a mess at 6 a.m. in the morning. Anyways, once I have my cup of juice, I'm ready to go. I start by taking out this trolley of pastries we have prepared the day before. The cling film has already been taken off. I'm just pulling it out of our walk-in fridge. And I'm going to start baking all of these pastries at once because these are about to like disappear in a second as soon as we send them out to the buffet. I start placing them in the oven and then I set them to bake. Then it's time to take them out once they are done baking. And here is what they look like, all freshly baked and out of the oven and then it is time to set them on the plates to go out to the buffet and of course firstly i have to make sure my hands are clean before touching the pastries with my bare hands and i just set those all on the plates we have some croissants we have some danish swirls apple puffs we have some pan au chocolat and then we have some savor options like pastetsi which i'm not showing here and then I set up my trolley and it's time to set up the buffet. Here is what the buffet looks like to the guest. This is actually while I was setting up before it was open. So as you can see, this is the entire pastry section. We have about six types of pastries, baked pastries. Then we have about four types of sliced cakes, chocolate cake, lemon cake, banana cake, and fruit cake. And we also have two types of muffins. And over there you're seeing the bread section we have normally about six to seven types of bread and then we were done and it was time for the guests to come in the buffet normally takes place from 7 to 11 a.m so until then it's all hands on deck so today since i got there early i was in charge of setting up the buffet and then once the buffet was all set up it was pretty much just constantly going around, seeing what needs to be replaced, baking new pastries and so and so during this time. It's just going back and forth with all this running with pastries and baking pretty much for the next five hours. I actually don't mind this at all because I managed to get my steps in for the day. And if you're wondering how much steps I actually do, a breakfast shift normally gets me around between 10 to 16,000 steps per day. I then wait until 11.15 to clear everything up and then I just clean up the buffet, pack everything up, prepare new pastries for tomorrow and then go on my break. After my break, I normally start doing prep for the rest of my shift and since this was filmed on a Friday, our biggest priority was doing preparation for the dinner buffet the next day. Mainly just finishing off some bits and pieces and adding some final touches as everything would be already baked the day before and then all frozen to be taken out and garnished the same day the food would be served. Now for my prep today, I am rolling out this giant block of marzipan and covering all these cakes with it. 
This was my first time working with marzipan and I actually found it to be so much easier and smoother to work with than fondant as it doesn't like crack at all. I then created a little twirl border to go all around the bottom edge of the cakes and blowtorch them to create this golden brown finish. The cakes were then put in the fridge and will be taken out and decorated tomorrow before they are placed on the buffet. We also had a guest call in from room service to order some chocolate covered strawberries so I went ahead and made those. Here are some clips of what the Saturday dinner buffet normally looks like. I actually took these clips from another day but I wanted you guys to see what the buffet typically looks like. And yeah, that's all I managed to film today because it was pretty hectic. If you guys would like to see more of my work vlogs, I do have a playlist and I do have some very similar vlogs showing you guys all the different things I do on different days at work while working at a five star hotel. And yeah, that is what a normal day looks like for me working as a pastry chef who is also a culinary student for a 6 a.m. breakfast shift. That is a little day of my life as a pastry chef and I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, if you are not updated but you would like to be, make sure to check out my Instagram at Marcy, M -A -R -R -S -S -Y, as well as my TikTok because I do post content on there sometimes at Mariah, M-A-R-R underscore I-A-H. I will see you very soon for another video. Bye guys.